<laughs> <Maturity levels. laughs> Ooh, what do we got today, Mr. Shawnee Boy? Corey Wagner, we got the Brew Dog Punk IPA. This is a postmodern classic, according to the can. 5.6%. Uh, we're working our way through the Scotland. Brew Dog Variety Pack, which has been really tasty. Gotta respect it, gotta love it. I love getting drunk in Scotland, like as if I could travel, so I like, think about being in Scotland and being drunk, but Just I'm... look in the mirror, bro, you basically in Scotland. That's a good point, man. <laughs> and today we're feasting on... Scotland's famous. Scotland's <laughs> famous Suki's Irresistible Indian Cuisine. We've got their chicken tikka masala with naan bread and basmati rice. One of my favorite rices. Oh, it's so good. Jasmine number one. Basmati number two. That's the Sean Ely exclusive. Love it, love it, love it. Yeah, so uh, Corey and I love Indian food. It's actually funny, a couple people have said like, why don't you guys do it for local foods? We should, a Wednesday video should be a local spot. We love Tandoor. Uh, there's a lot of other Indian places in Chicago that we should do, so maybe it'll become a trend. Right. This is out of a plastic dish. <laughs> Dude, ooh, kept the steam well. Sure did. Nothing like cooking your lunch or dinner or whatever you're having out of a microwave. I exfoliate with uh, these dishes. Oh, that's sometimes. a good. This is my skincare routine. Open the pores. All right, Suki's irresistible Indian cuisine. It's ironic calling it opening the pores because that's people generally call me the poor. Yeah, you're the poor. Mm-hmm. Oh boy. Oh, that's pretty. Sp that's delicious. A chicken has good consistency for being frozen. Mm. This is also 33 grams of protein if you're somebody who's trying to get ripped. Mm. And dude, the fact that they actually gave non bread with this, and this is like. It's not all like dry feeling, you know what I mean? I'm a fan of this. Yeah, I gotta try this naan. I'll try some naan. I can't believe that came frozen. Dude, they literally, they found a cheat code. I'm gonna make like a naan wrap. Oh my God. I'm about to get this again. Mm-hmm. Wow. That's really good. I think traditionally you don't even have a fork. You just use the bread to grab up. Your rice and your meat. Your rice and chicken, my uh, buddy Zach Phillips. Oh. Spent a little time in India. And that's what he told me. He could be a liar. I don't know. That's so good. I can't believe this is frozen, dude. Right? And that's the that's the win. Mm -hmm. If people think that, that's the win. Right? I'm so happy with this. <laughs> I feel like sometimes we have some crap food on Fridays. Yeah. As is the case, frozen food. Yeah. We've been on a heater, dude. We've been on a streak of some like good meals. Yeah. This luck streak is gonna run out hard. Mm. That is terrific. Mm. Bro, that basmati rice, dude. Look like America being like, now white or brown? And then like other places are like jasmine and basmati. Like why is America like the color of it? <laughs> it's yeah, right. like so lame. I can't believe they froze naan bread and you heat it up in the microwave and it's good. Like that is very shocking to me. Oh my God, I'm stuffed. Mm. Hopefully one day I can travel again and go to India because it's on the bucket list. Oh bro, India would be so sick to go to. Mm -hmm. Dude, you are a... Um absolute vacuum cleaner. Uh, dude, during this quarantine, before we went to quarantine, I would like only eat a few bites of each meal. I'm getting fat, bro. I'm trying to. I'm like, I'm like, dude, food makes me, it's the only thing that makes me happy anymore. Every single gym. Stuff it down. Will, their whole marketing thing will be like, do you need to lose the quarantine oh 15? God. I'm happy, dude. Dude, I just, I feel like I'm, I feel like a liar. I feel like these people are gonna stop trusting me. Yeah. Cause I feel like lately I, on all our Friday videos, I've just been like, great, great. These are all the best fry, these are the best frozen food items. But they, we've been on a streak where three of the last four or five frozen food items we've done have been some of my favorite frozen food items I've had set. Like, absolutely. In the history of the show, it's just been luck of the draw, I guess, I don't know. I mean, if what we need, to find happiness is a frozen food Indian meal. I'll accept that. If you know, that's what it takes to make me happy these days, so be it. I'll take that. You guys need to get this, but maybe not. I don't know. We still gotta do it. Alright, before we go ahead and thumbs up or thumbs down this unbelievable chicken teams up. Let's do a shout out. Vlog shout out, vlog shout out, vlog shout out. Boy oh boy, do we have an awesome channel for you. If you want more Corey and Sean, there's a couple ways you can get it. Go check out our vlog channel ASAP. It's called Corey and Sean, and if you just type that into the old YouTubers, you'll find our channel, and on that you'll find all kinds of amazingness. It's less about food, more about our general lives in Chicago, us just kind of hopping around the city, showing off all the sweet events and fun activities that Chicago has to offer. If you're interested in vlogging, or just in more Corey and Sean, this is a great way to get it. Go to youtube.com forward slash Corey and Sean, 
And then hit that subscribe button and you'll see all kinds of fun festivities. That's true. Oh, but anyways, God. thanks so much for subscribing to the vlog channel. And now the moment of truth. You want to know if you should buy this. Eric McCluskey, drum roll please. Ooh, he's wearing the Eric McCluskey Mike Omley knit shirt. Yes. Thumbs up or thumbs down on whether or not you liked, you enjoyed, you might overall get again. The Suki's Chicken Tiki Masala. Oh! oh. Fantastic! Though. I'm so happy that this exists. I, I was a little nervous that it wasn't gonna be like all that it was cracked up to be. That really came through. That's yeah. unbelievable. There are two types of people: people who love Indian cuisine and the people who just haven't tried it yet. I honestly think that's so true. People that yeah. don't like Indian food, I feel like you haven't had it yet. Totally. It's just meat and a protein and a delicious sauce. What, what, what are you yeah, talking about? Dumb. You eat McDonald's. <laughs> That's a weird example. Uh, guys, we'll see you Monday for a brand new episode. Thank you so much for watching five straight videos this week. New episode, 9 a.m. Central, every single weekday. Sure! I'll eat a bucket of Indian food, <laughs> and then I'll have a drag. Dude, certified halal. I don't know what that means, but it says certified by the Islamic Services of America. So, legit. Have a good weekend. Try not to get alcohol poisoning again. Oh, damn, that was sick, yeah.